Hello and welcome to my channel. Uh, on my channel I will be reviewing mostly watches, but from time to time other luxury accessories, like leather accessories, maybe some electronics, we'll see how it will develop during the time. I'm a watch enthusiast for a couple of years now, watch collector also, 2-3 uh, years at least, and I'm buying and selling a lot of watches, uh, mostly for myself of course, but uh, I thought why not to document and uh, all of them, and why not show uh, some not that common, maybe some unusual watches to public uh, and to you. Uh, a little bit regret I didn't do this before, um, but I will try to make some video maybe from pictures because I have uh, all the pictures that I, of watches that I had in pa in the past. And today uh, I have uh, not that known company. Uh, maybe it's known, but not for watches. Uh, the company name is Mode Design, it's an Italian company, and they're doing mostly luxury uh, car accessories. But for a couple of years now, they're also doing watches. And one of them I want to show you today. Uh, so uh, here we have a box, out of box, nothing special, uh, as usual. I have to say, uh, this is a used watch. Uh, I'm buying. Uh, I'm from time to time I'm buying also new watches, but uh, in my opinion, most of new watches are really overpriced. So that's why I'm trying to find used one in good condition uh, for fair price. Fair price, in my opinion. I'm buying watches uh, if the price is right for me, at least. <laughs> okay, uh, this is outer box, and here we have inner box. As you can see, it's quite nice. It's not like cheap plastic from China. This is quite thick. Uh, uh, nice bolt engraving. Uh, nicely done. You can see it. But of course, watch box is not the most important important part of the watch. Mm, we have also inter warranty, some price tag. This was a full set, so watch had everything, not the new one. Uh, and now about the watch. As you can see, this is diver style watch. Mm, this is made in Italy watch. Um, like it states here. Mm, well, many companies uh, like to tell the origin of the watch. Uh, nowadays, not only Swiss made watches are good, uh, you can find great watches from almost all over the world, to be honest. Uh, it depends on the company and the quality that uh, they want to provide to their customers. Um, what's really interesting about this piece? Uh, uh, as you can see, it's blue one. <laughs> If this PVD blue PVD coating is quite rare, um, to be honest, maybe it was the first one watch that I uh, see in blue PVD coating. That's why I bought it. To be honest, it's not quite my style, so that's why I'm not keeping it. But uh, overall, uh, it was very, uh, very well made, and that's why I want to show it to you. Mm. Finish of the watch is nice. Uh, as you can see, uh, it's a highly polished. Uh, Outer bezel, it's catching the uh, light quite nicely. Today is not that sunny day, so uh, maybe the, with sun, with the sun, it will be better. But but I think you can see it. Um, here you can see nicely finish, uh, polish, uh, matte, and polish again, different layers. Uh, try to catch focus. You have one crown, also second crown, sign with Momo logo. And this is the bezel, uh, crown to move inner bezel. If you want to use some dive function. Uh, movement is partially skeletonized with date uh, between four and five. Uh, crown is a screw down, screw down type. And uh, Movement itself, it's moving quite nicely because uh, watch is Italian made, but it's powered by Swiss made, Swiss made movement, ETA 2824. 
probably the most common Swiss uh, movement in the world, to be honest. But it's uh, quite nice, solid, reliable, and you can feel it uh, uh, even when, when you set the time. It's moving smoothly, very nice. Uh, as you can see, it's also have a hacking second, sub second. Stop and go. I can set the date, quick set date. Quite nice. Mm, what else? Um, keep in mind that this is my first video, so uh, I will improve over time. I want to make uh, one uh, video every week to show you all uh, my collection and probably I will buy some new watches during the time so I, ha I hope I will have a lot of watches to review. Um, you can see also the back, not mostly thrilling but uh, not the most thrilling but quite nice, nicely polished. Mm. Interesting thing is also the buckle, big size one, uh, with the logo on the top, also nicely finished. One thing that I don't like about this watch is the strap, mm, because uh, if you can see, it catches the dust. Um, High-end watches, uh, I'm not a big fan of rubber straps to be honest, but uh, with high-end watches, and the strap is made uh, some kind of special caoutchouc that it don't catch dust at all. And here you can see dust, so probably strap could be a little bit better. But it's not like a top high-end watch, so uh, you can also always change the strap uh, with a leather one, maybe some other rubber, something that will fit you better. Um, what else? I will show you some close-ups. I'm making this video with my mobile, so also maybe it won't be the best quality. But I, as I said, this is my first video. I will improve. You can be sure about it. You can also see strap. I said it's not the best, but it's nicely customized. You can see here also name of the company. Hmm. I will show you how it looks on the wrist. It's a little bit too big, but for me, but not that much. I have to say the watch is nice. If somebody is into a diver watch, and you can find this piece for quite a good price, you won't be disappointed. I think you will like it a lot. And it's powered by Swiss movement, so uh, that's why you can also rely on it. As I said, it's for sure not most common watch. I want to make review of some interesting pieces. I show them to the public. Okay. Also, I think that's it. It was Momo Design watch. And that's it. Thank you. Have a good day.